Go ahead. Yeah, they got but, you rated as one of the 25 most anti-freedom raps in New Hampshire. Well, anti-freedom. Are, are, are they unfair? What does that mean, anti-freedom? To me, it means that you're willing to use the government to initiate force against people to collect money to solve problems. See, I think government is a vehicle to help people. It should be. And that is where I think we have this fundamental disagreement, you know? Plus, I think that... Your group, and you seem to be very upfront about it, is that you are indeed a free stater and you advocate and promote this uh, free state libertarian sort of uh, mindset that wants to make New Hampshire into some kind of, uh, I'll use it, my term is sort of a social service laboratory. And uh, I find that to be uh, um, something I don't agree with. What's funny, I'm always telling people that I don't take advice from opponents, but I'm going to ask you anyway. What, what do you think we should do if not relocate, escape our totalitarian states that we came from? Well, well I think there's, see, there's this fundamental belief by people like myself that you're really not escaping, you're invading. And your goal is to, because you know best, to take over New Hampshire. Now, I live on the Vermont border, and, and I don't sort of see myself as, you know, over here or over yeah. there, right or left. I, I don't really see myself that way. Um, well, the NHLA ratings well, indicate that's, that's you're fine. authoritarian. Yeah. Well, yes, yes, sure, but I, I don't see myself in that capacity. Mm -hmm. So I, growing in the, up in the Connecticut River Valley, being a, a, a native of, of uh, the Connecticut River Valley and having real ties to Vermont, I've seen in Vermont, an invasion from the other end of the spectrum. I've seen a lot of these um, liberal left of center individuals who've moved in, taken over, become members of the planning boards, the zoning boards, the municipal, municipal board of selectmen, and, and in fact shut the door behind them and now trying to control the state of Vermont from a, a, from a liberal perspective. Right, well, I see your folks doing the same thing and trying to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Well, having been here and as somebody who is here, I find that offensive. So, yeah, it's so carpet, like the carpetbagger thing. Well, yeah. if you, that's your term, but I, I see it as invaders. You know? That's right, and that's what has always been kind of important to me to yeah. not be that as best I can, yeah. but well, be I am, here and I live actually, as much freedom actually, as I, I can. I you know, am so. impressed. I find your your videos on YouTube entertaining. I don't agree with most of them, but I do find them entertaining, and I do. But you like me more than a lot of liber liberty folk in that case. <laughs> well, I find them entertaining, and I find that in some cases, and there's one recently you actually, I thought, touched a real cur a real nerve about uh, uh, some of the attacks on on representative um, oh, uh, I'm drawing Chase, yeah, Chase. Yeah. you know um, that that some of the uh, the comments by people who subscribe to your way of thinking were as uh, as um, equally as offensive as what they were claiming she had done. Well, I, some of them said it first. It's uh, dangerous. I, I got some... So, you know, short of sending you guys off all to the salt mines, I guess, you know... We Which have could to, happen at some point. Well, we have, it to may. Come, we have to combat with you. We have to do combat with you. And and, and I think I'm from the belief it's, that government works and that government has a place and that when you deregulate and when you dismantle and when you walk away, you, you're walking away from services to working class regular guys. And, and that's who I am. Driving in circles around Central Keene, I hurl both insults, angry and mean, against the activists from Free Keene, uh, who wander around thinking as though they were free, and even though they aren't hurting me, I will hate them hatefully. Urging their appearance in the penitentiary. Although that expense would be charged to me. I'm starting to feel 
somewhat confusedly.